Welcome to season four of the Minnesota State Mavericks Dynasty. And today, the Minnesota State Mavericks are here taking on the Michigan Wolverines in the first game of season four. And uh, if you guys are excited, drop a like. If you're new, subscribe for more content. So, about the last season, you know, we, we went 12 and 2, which is also re it's really impressive. I think that's really good. Yeah, we all can agree. Yeah. But this year, we want to do a little bit more than just... We want to do that and then some. Um, granted, there were a lot of close games last year. And I don't know. With a lot of these close games, you can kind of tell, like... You know, so I may get lucky. I may not be. I, it all depends. So, we're going to look here at the recruiting board. Uh, we got a lot of good players now. A bunch of them uh, 60 plus. Which, you know, I, these guys can be secret gems. You know, Andy Slater. I'm hoping I can get him. So he turns, He's turning out to be a gem. Um, we, we're still behind on a lot of these guys, but that's okay. Um, I offered pretty much all these guys scholarships. And, you know, I have a feeling I'll get still some of these guys here. But I'm not going to be holding my breath um, if I don't get the, these bottom tier guys. But the ones over 60 and uh, over like 57 overall here, I really want to get off to those guys. Because, you know, they're going to make us... You know, they're going to make us succeed in the long term as far as how the rules are played and everything like that. So we'll see how this season turns out with them and and beyond, actually. So, uh, 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 you know, I feel comfortable with the recruiting, even though we're only going after one-star players. So with that, let's look at the uh, top 25. I know I showed it to you guys in the last one, but I'm only going to touch the top 25 this time. Uh, Ohio State, Alabama, Oklahoma, Georgia, Stanford, a and Notre Dame, Florida, Michigan, and LSU are 1 through 10. 11 through 20 is Clemson, Washington, Nebraska, Pitt, TCU, NC State, West Virginia, uh, North Carolina, uh, Mississippi State, and Virginia Tech. 21 through 25 are UCF, Flor or California, Baylor, Penn State, and Auburn. Um, we have some breaking news coming in that we have a Heisman candidate too. Brett Brown is your is a serious dark horse. This is I don't know how. I honestly don't. I, I'm just like, how did this happen? But he is a Heisman candidate as of right now, and I'm hoping that we could turn that into an actual you know win for us. If he could stay in the race, that would be something. Because if he stay, if he's, if he stays in the race this year, if he performs well, he may be a contender for it next year too. So we gotta really put him to the forefront of the offense this year, uh, if he wants any chance at the Heisman. So that's that. Conference outlook: We're projected to finish first place in the MAC. In the MAC West, we have Ohio, who's projected to finish first in that uh, side this year. But only time will tell where that's going to go. Um, championship contenders list. We're ranked number 50, but um, I don't anything like this. We're still projected to finish dead last in all these, but that obviously doesn't seem to change anything really. I mean, at the end of the day, we're still going to be there. But anyway, let's get on with this game against Michigan at the big house. Dude, this is going to be a crazy game. I may lose this game. I may win it. We 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 won one top 25 game last year against USC. I'm hoping we can come out and just flat out surprise Michigan. I will see you guys on the field. And we are underway from the big house as we're going to receive the kickoff. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Can we get a block or two? Oh, it looks like we might get something. Oh, not. Or not. But still, I'll, we'll, we'll see what we could do this time around against a Michigan defense that's looking pretty hungry. I got to remember this time around, too. My tight ends are not nearly as good. <laughs> oh, what a great, what a play. Garrison Burnett, what a, he broke the sack, took off running, throws it on the run to Gary, and gained a 21 later. That's a first down. Oh, sometimes getting it done the ugly way is the only way. Oh, there's Gary again. Another gain of 20 plus. 
Look at this drive. Oh, Gary again with his third straight catch and another first. Okay. He didn't cut back up field like he should have. 32 yard field goal, splits the uprights. And we don't get shut out today. That works. It's second down. Okay. I mean, I didn't expect him to pass on that play then. Wow, okay. The 10. Touchdown. Jeez. You, like, you couldn't just roll over any further than that? I mean, you just could have just... I mean, you could have, like, done anything besides that. Oh! Come on, Tavon! There you go! Already in great field position. Plays like that last one that give me aneurysms. Easy catches that just go dropped. He's under pressure. And a quick throw. And Fourth and inches. Oh, we're going for it. I know Scooter's got the big, the big motor. Big motor. That's all we need. Motor ran. What's your price for flights? Oh, look at that play. Oh, look at Jacob Jackson. First and goal. 23 yards. The safety did a nice job of stepping up from the secondary. Made a good stop before he could get many yards. Touchdown. Minnesota State. May not be still very good, but we got to make improvements. And if we can make those improvements, we can do a lot of damage this year. Yeah, let's go! Come on, D! Let's go! And that's a great way to stick. Wait, see what happens when you stick with the run? Good things happen. Eventually, start, stuff starts hoping up, and that play kind of happens. Like, negative two yards rushing. And taking sacks like that definitely does not help. To go here before they got a score. Oh, I smell a screen. Ooh, he got absolutely nailed. Okay. And of course he can't make the tackle. Well, ain't that a load of crap? Why, why don't we just, you know, bow down to these guys? You know, that's the whole goal, right? Is to just completely bow down. Nice catch, Jake. First down. Catch the easy ones. That's all I ask. You're not making the easy catches. Oh my god, intercepted. Now we're beating ourselves. This is why we keep losing games. Because Gary can't catch in track. Like, do a simple catch. And that's on offsides. It's on it's the 12 yard line. Third down. Oh, thank goodness. I hate Garrison. He just can't catch. He doesn't catch the big ones. 
Henry Dillon, on the other hand. Dude, seriously! How many, how many interceptions are you gonna grab? I know, just thin air. Now I'm getting, I'm getting pissed because now I'm getting ripped off. That is not a catch. Stop it. He's out of bounds. They have two interceptions in the first half because my receivers are that incompetent and can't catch a dang pass. Okay, I mean, that wasn't even close. Inter nope, not intercepted, but we'll take that. I can't believe they went four verts. Well, that was just a well-executed play. They picked a perfect time to stretch the defense with a passing play, and it worked. Henry Dillon, just give it to him. Got to float it up there. Barry, you got to make these catches, dude. Hey, he caught one in traffic. Wow, amazing what you can do when you catch. Touchdown. Okay. And that's a catch at another first down because no one covers. You pass from this team? Do I see screen passes? Or maybe I don't, and I'm just dreaming. Dude, tackle the son of a... Oh, my God. Why are we giving up so many dumb plays? I don't care what position he is. He gets first downs every time. It doesn't every time he touches the ball, it's a first down. Intercepted! What a read! Oh, you have made a giant mistake! Marcus Anderson! It's gonna be interesting now to see Okay, we got a lead to start the second half now. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. Ronnie Bell, gain of 11. Ball on the 39 yard line. Scrambling around. He decides to run with it. Dude, you shouldn't even be breaking tackles. You're a quarterback. Don't forget your man. And he's got the junior. And they make the stop. Can Ronnie Bell stop catching the ball, please? That'd be great. That's good enough to pick Can't up the stop him down. on third. It's been the story of the whole game. Dude, seriously, let him just walk into the end zone. Every time he got, touches the ball, it's a first down or more. Three. We had a lead, but we never took the we never took the field on offense. As much as I hate Garrison, Garrison sometimes he does. He's been. There we go. First down again. Groups out there, my my guy. You're the man. You are the man, Brett. You're the man to lead these troops. Okay, let's go. Let's bring it. Bring it, dude. Wazlik gain of four. That's a four yard gain there. Oh my god. Excellent open field tackle. Good pitching. Ready, 
Garrison Burnett's second touchdown of the game. Dude, bring him down the first time. I'm tired of this guy running all over us. Fuck this piece of shit. Oh, what the hell? Is that a fullback screen? That was a fullback screen, I think. Come on, screen. You knew he was going to go to the corner of the end zone. I don't know why you guys weren't there. All right, got another first down. Seven catches, 89 yards. Not bad. From their own 31 yard line, it's first down. Dude, Jacob Jackson, gain of 18. Let's go. So, we're not doomed. Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. Utley's got some motor. Utley's has a motor, though, at least. That I can live. The bad news is, is we got third and three. Oh, Cooper. Oh. Yes. 34 all. You can make that guy miss. It allows you to turn oh man, I smell it. I can see it. Play. This guy has such powerful legs as we've seen all day today. An arm tackle's not going to bring him down. You've got to get in front of him. Okay, we didn't let him get the yards after the catch. That's a, that's at least a plus. Oh, this is clutch. Ball on the 38. Clutch team, man. We clutch. Oh my god, how could you give up that play, Vaden? Or whoever your name is, 45. Got his receiver, touchdown. We have two minutes left, all three of our timeouts, so we're good. And that's a good start with that first down. Henry Dillon. This man is already turning into a, ble a legend. Fuck Michigan and everything they fucking stand for. Joe Cooper, gain of 22. Yeah, there we go. Okay, works for me. Second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. And it's a touchdown. Oh, gee, a handoff. And touchdown. All right. Double OT. So. Oh, boy. Blaine Waters is still trash. As shown right here, exhibit A. Knock down that per carry average, the better. Or not. We had four guys converging on him, and none of them could bring him down. Just to let you know, this guy. Stop taking that was a useless sack. Oh, Henry Dillon over the top. Tackle 
And we finally rush a hundred for a hundred yards as a team. That's thirteen yard line. It's first down. Oh, look at Gary. <laughs> well, we're in for a shootout, boys. Uh, we have to go for two. First and goal for Michigan. They just are doing. They are doing whatever they want. We're both doing whatever we want. And a two-point conversion will come. 63-61. Oh, God, Jesus. Stop them here, guys. This is what we need. This is what we came here for. A chance at an upset. Oh, my God! We stopped them! Why did they go underneath? Why did they go? I don't even know. Wow. Unbelievable. I thought that was a guaranteed two-point conversion. Because they've been doing everything and anything to us. Granted, we, we both, both teams made their own fair share of mistakes. And all that good stuff. But, but hey, we won. We beat Michigan. So... 1-0. Hey, well, that's the first time we've gone 1-0 in a dy this dynasty. Hey, we'll take it. Next week, we take on Minnesota. Should be a good one. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, my name is Sim with Vengeance. You guys have been amazing as always. Peace out.